In today's video, guys, we are building Premier League teams using the Wheel of Death. Not quite the Wheel of Death, but this is something I've seen on social media, on TikTok, and I absolutely love watching those videos where people build teams. Today, specifically, we're going with Premier League squads and it's randomized based off a wheel or, you know, on TikTok, you have that filter that shows different clubs. I'm sure you guys have seen it. And we're going to do two squads today and I want you guys to play along. So whatever club pops up, you've got a few seconds. Okay, do not pause the video and research. It needs to be based off your knowledge, really quick knowledge of who plays for who, positions, all of that good stuff. Play along with me and let's see who can create the best squads. Now, the first squad is going to be you can pick any position as you get each club. And then the second challenge is going to be goalkeeper all the way up to striker in a row. And it's much, much harder to build. What I would say is going to be the challenge of building a title winning side. OK, so I'll be I'll be building the team as we go, but I will make my choices live very quickly and we will spin the wheel. Let's just go. Let's go for it. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. It's something different. I'm working on my new career mode project. It's coming very soon. We're going to spin it for the first time in this episode. And I'm hoping it gives us a really good start. Oh, oh, stop. No. Okay. Oh, oh okay. I'd, I'd rather Tottenham if I'm honest. So Southampton, I am going to go with... Ooh. I think James Ward Prowse. So let me go ahead and add him in. We'll go J W P. He's added into central midfield. Now I'm going to go with a 4 2 3 1. So that means we're going to go with two center mids and one attacking midfielder, but also feel free to do a 4 4 2 or a 4 3 3. Just make sure you have four defenders. I think that's, we should do a four defense formation. Um, now, what I've noticed is with this wheel, sometimes it, it keeps on one side. So what I'm going to do is restart it every time. So start again and let's spin it. So as I said, in challenge number one, you're building it as you go in any position that you want. And it's going to that left side again. But this time we've got Liverpool. Stop. Oh, really? We've been given Everton. Oh, that's quite difficult, actually. I think I'm going to go with Pickford in goal. I think that's the best shout, and I'm hoping most people would agree with that. So we'll go Pickford, just making sure that you can see that. Yeah, so we've got Ward Prowse and Pickford. Let's just test this. Let's click resume. Let's see if it goes to Everton again, then we know it's it's a little bit buggy and I need to actually refresh it. But so far, I'm quite happy with that. That's not too bad. It is working. Okay, we are going towards Manchester United. Please stay. Oh, Rashford. <laughs> We're going to go with Leicester. And I think that's a very obvious one. We're going to go with Madison. I don't know if it is it is. It, oops, I've spelled that wrong. Is it two? We'll just go with that. I think it's two D's, right? It might it might not be, but I think you, you guys know who I mean. Right. That's quite good, though. I like Madison. I think he's one of the most underrated players. Well, is he underrated? I think he's one of the best players not to be in one of those top six clubs, you know? And this time we are given Chelsea, please. Chelsea, 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 Chelsea. Yes. Ooh, do I go Thiago Silva? Do I go... Oh, it has to be Enzo, doesn't it? it? It has to be Enzo. Enzo Fernandez into my midfield. We've already built our midfield three. That trio is looking pretty good. Spin it. Let's go with hopefully a winger or a striker. I, I need like a, a Man City and Arsenal, United. It's going to be... No, no, no. Okay, yeah, I'll take Wolves. I'll take... Newcastle. Give me Newcastle. Give me Newcastle. Oh. oh, I would have taken Nunes. I would have taken Nunes. I think I'm going to go with... Ah. I have to decide. I have to decide. Ah. Oh, it's so risky. Okay, I've decided. Um, I'm going to go with... What's the centre-back called? The English guy. Left-footed. Kilman. <laughs> Literally, I bet you guys are just screaming at me. I'm going with a balanced defense. I need that left footed center back. And I think he's very good. I could have gone with, you know, a winger. I could have gone with Neto maybe, or um, maybe I could have gone with a striker. I would have taken Neves or Nunes, ideally. Into the next one, it's going to be West Ham, please. Or it's Bournemouth, Southampton. It's Southampton. Uh... 
It's not ideal, is it? I'm going to take Bella Kotchap, maybe? No, I'll go James Ward Prow uh, not Ward Prowse. Um, Carl Walker Peters. So we'll just do KWP. Carl Walker Peters at right back. This is not a title winning side right now, is it? I am excited to see what you guys come up with in team one. I think if you could put the comment as team one, then list it. And then team two, list that one. Please stop. Damn it. I'm getting really unlucky here. It's going to be Everton again. Uh, we will go with... Oh. See, I'm thinking Calvert-Lewin in form is a, good a very good option. But I might take... Uh, I wanted Onana. I'm going to go left back. I'm going to take Mikolenko. Oh, no. Uh, that? <laughs> got, I've got some dust on my screen. That's annoying. Mikolenko? I, 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 don't, I don't think that's too bad, but there's no way I'm building a title-winning side right now. And the pressure really does get to you when you when you get the club and you go, oh, my God, I've got to think of something. But we need a centre-back. We need wingers. Please stop, stop, stop. Oh, you got you guys know it's Harry Maguire going into defence. No, it's, it's definitely not. It's going to be Rashford down that left side. Do you know what? My midfield is carrying me right now. I think Ward Prowse is good, but let's let's realistically say Enzo Madison and Rashford is... Oof, that is rather tasty. And Ward Prowse on free kicks. I mean, he's a good midfielder anyway. I'd be worried a little bit about not having a proper DM in there, but I guess Enzo can do that. Looks like we're going to get Crystal Palace. Um, I will go with Olise on the right side, I think. I really like Olise. Obviously, I could throw Zaha down the right. I could have gone with a centre-back, actually. I could have gone with Gerhi or Anderson. But I'm going to take Olise because I actually really rate him. I think he's a very good player. I think if he was in a team that had more possession... We might see more of him, a slightly better player out of him. And it's going to fall on Arsenal, please. Please stop. Oh, <laughs> striker or centre-back? Um, well, Jesus or Saliba? Do you know what? I'm going Saliba. Jesus hasn't played in a while, so we'll go with Saliba. Now we have one spin left. I swear, if I get Man City... Um, Oh, i take Tottenham to get Kane in the team, maybe. What's it going to be? Newcastle's good. I'll take Newcastle. West Ham. Hmm. <laughs> uh, Skamaka, no. Oh, it's not ideal, really, is it? I, th I think I'll take him. I don't, uh, is that how you spell it? Skamaka? Skamaka? Well, either way. I think you know who I mean. So that is team number one complete. Is that going to win the title? No. I, I think it could push for European spots. But, you know, with Skamaka up top, Elise is a slightly weaker option there. He's not the most experienced. I think my defence would struggle uh, over 38 games against, you know, the top sides. Uh, it's not awful, though. And I would give the captain's armband to Ward Prowse, by the way, I think. He would be my captain. So... That's team number one. Let me know how you get on. And that is, of course, building it with freedom. But now team two or challenge number two is going to be goalkeeper all the way through up to striker. We're going to go goalkeeper, then to right back, then across to midfield and then wingers, and then striker. OK, and you just have to take the badges as they come. There's there's no re-spinning. There's, there's none of that. You can't decide where the players are going to go. It is just simple as... This one's goalkeeper. I have to take a goalkeeper. And it's not bad if, if it stays with Brighton or Fulham. Mm, Fulham's pretty good, actually. Obviously, we're going to go ahead and take Leno there. So let's go ahead and throw him in goal. Can you guys see that? It is working. Let me go ahead and spin the wheel again. Do you know what? If I make a better team with this system, I will be very surprised. This makes it a lot, a lot harder. Looks like we're going to get Southampton. And this is, of course, right back. Oh, yep, it is right back. So for the second time in a row, we are getting KWP. I mean, you could take the ex-Chelsea youngster. Um, again, my mind's just gone completely blank. What's his name? Liveramento. Could potentially go with him. Into the first centre-back out of the two. Stop. 
Uh, it's not awful. Um, I want to take Pinnock, but I also quite like Ben Me. That's tricky. Do you know what? I'm actually going to go with Ben Me, and just because he's left-footed, I'll put him on the left side. Okay, that's fine. We're we're picking two centre backs. It doesn't matter which side they're on, does it? All right, we're going to go with Ben Me. I've been impressed with Ben Me. Very experienced. He, he was a manager for for a little short while, wasn't he? When um, Sean Dyche left um, Burnley. I was going to say Brentford. Was it? Yeah, it was. Leeds United centre-back. We are going to go with... Oh, I could have taken their new signing. Is it Herber? H Hober? I'm going to go with Cock. <laughs> so childish. Right. Left back up next. I would have taken Leeds for a left back, maybe. I quite like Firpo. Um, but obviously, there are some other very good choices. Give me give me Chelsea. Okay, that's not good. Loddy. Okay, we're going to get ourselves Loddy. Wolfsburg legend in my recent career mode. We'll go Loddy at left back. I'm just going to say this now. That defence is not top four worthy at all, let alone win the title worthy. At the moment, I think we'd get top eight maximum. So let's see as we go into midfield. Our first central midfielder, it's going to be Manchester United. I'm going to go with Casemiro because you'd be mad not to. He is definitely a DM, but he can obviously slot in at central midfield very easily. Now, who is going to partner him? Give me... Mm, Man City, please. I'd like a De Bruyne. Okay. Okay. It's going to be Crystal Palace. Oof. Who are they playing in central midfield? Oh, I wish they still had Gallagher. I'd put Gallagher in there. Um, central midfield. Oh, my God. My mind's gone completely blank. Is it Decore? Not the Decore at Everton. There's a, is, they've got another Decore, haven't they? And he seems pretty good. Milivojevic has been good over the years. Uh, but in general, this is a bit of a stinker. I'll put Decore in, although I'm actually... Um, I'm, I'm not sure if it's... Is that his name? And I've probably spelt his name wrong as well. Is it Decore? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I've spelt that right. There is one midfielder for Crystal Palace that I do actually like. He's he's a relatively new signing. I could have put Lekonga in there. He's on loan. <laughs> no, Lekonga would not get into the team. I, I'll have to double check that Decore pick in a moment. Looks like we're going towards Arsenal here. Hello, this is for a cam. You are kidding me. Really? Right. Well, that sucks. I could have gone Erdegaard and instead, does Christie work down through the middle or do we go with Billing? He has been playing a slightly further role and I'm, I'm going to go with Billing. Do you know what? I reckon Billing, Casemiro and Decore, if that is actually his name, they could do a job for me. Billing is a giant as well. Good in the box. I think six foot seven or something. Really tall, strong. Could do a good job for us. So this is right midfield. Oh my god, Saka, no. Saka, no. Oh, and Boimo maybe. Liverpool. No. I could have had Salah. I'm getting so unlucky here. This is ridiculous. I'm gonna go and Boimo. He obviously he plays as a striker, as a second striker, but he has played a lot of his time at Brentford on the right wing as well. So we'll go with Brentford's and Boimo. Over onto the left side here. I have been shafted big time. This has been awful. What's it going to be this time? Is it going to be West Ham? It's going to be Leeds. Do you know what? I would have liked Tottenham more, but there is one player that I think absolutely is going to blow up in the next few years, and that is Nonto. This guy, what was it, 5 million? Less than 5 million to Leeds? He has looked very... Very good, but it's, it's still very early days in his career. He's not going to help us win the title with this team. This team is rubbish. It's actually awful. <laughs> but the fun of this video is me going through the comments later and seeing what, what teams you guys have built. What is this? Oh, my God. And our striker is going to be Watkins. Oh, man. Yeah, that's not winning a title. 
That is absolutely not even getting top four. It might not even get top eight. My God, I hope you guys have built better sides than me, but I can't think of what I could have done better. Midfielders for Crystal Palace really threw me. Yeah, let's double check. I was right. It is Decore. This guy here. Very, very good midfielder. Who could have we have gone with? Hughes, MacArthur, Schlupp wouldn't have been a bad choice. Um, I mean, I did think of Eze and Olise, but they're not central midfielders. So actually, do you know what? I'm quite happy with that. I look forward to seeing your comments. Have you built better sides than me? Obviously, there is there is no actual winner. It's all to do with your own personal um, opinions of players. But do you know what? The, that first team I built wasn't good enough to get a title win. And this team is definitely not.